in an incredibly deep and talented wide receiver class, the Green Bay Packers did not select a single receiver. Yeah, I got a lot of DMs that aren't good. Grassy Posse Packer Nation. Welcome to the episode of Packcast, the podcast where you don't do a Packers fan. But it sure does help. I'm your host, Tom. What has my life become? The Packers, they had a need. They had a need for wide receiver. And yet it fell through their fingers. I even bought a draft cap. But alas, it has failed me. And so now I sit here in my basement, ready to take a toaster bath. Grassi. And today we're going to take a look at the final pick of the Green Bay Packers 2020 NFL Draft. And that is Jonathan Garvin, the edge out of Miami with the 242nd pick in the 2020 NFL Draft. Yeah, um, I actually really like this pick because I think this guy is screaming with potential. I don't like a lot of things he did beforehand, but at 6'4", 263 pounds, ran a 4'8", 240, has, uh, like I said about the potential, he needs a better second effort in that he kind of just gives up on plays, but in 2018, had 20 solo tackles, 17 for a loss, five and a half sacks, and even five passes defended. In 2019, he had 21 solo tackles, nine for a loss, five sacks, and two forced fumbles. And he... He, it makes sense. Like, there is rumors that he could potentially go in uh, on day two, but I can, looking at some of his tape, I can see why he fell to day three because, like, there are times where you watch him and you're like, wow, this guy's a stud. And then there's other times where you're like, wow, he just completely gave up. He's such a hot and cold um, prospect, and that's why he went as late as he did. So all the potential is there in the world for them to potentially get that out of Garvin, and he definitely could be a good backup. Is that going to happen? Well, I mean, this is definitely like Mike Pettin's guy. Like this, this is a Mike Pettin pick. So obviously we don't have like the biggest need for edge, but I mean, it's not like we were drafting wide receivers. So yeah, I actually like this pick uh, and I would have liked this pick if we picked differently a little bit beforehand. Um, but as it is, solid prospect. I'm going to have to sit on this draft for a little bit cry a little bit, drink a little bit, ponder my life a little bit. We'll have grades on Monday. But let me know what you think down in the comments below. You can always find me at TomGrassyComedy.com or at TomGrassyComedy on all social media. See down below. Check out podcasts on SoundCloud, iTunes, Google Play Music, Spotify, and of course YouTube. And a big shout out and thank you to all the Patreon members over at Patreon.com slash TomGrassyComedy. But thank you so much for watching. Thank you for sticking with me for this entire draft process. I hope you've enjoyed it. I'm Tom Grassi. And as always, go back, go. (laughs) 